<laughs> All right, now it's time to see what's hot and happening on the country music scene. Our good friend Rick Rush from WZL joining us with some of that Nashville news. That is look at this. I got dressed up. Show your shirt off. Look at that. In my Wait, life. Look at this. Hang on, hang on. Hang on. It's supposed to look like a blue. <laughs> this is an exact. Uh, is uh, amazing. I found this on uh, uh, Amazon.com. An exact you, replica of what Tom Crawford wore to his prom mm -hmm. in the '70s. We have that. Yeah. Yeah. '71 Kylo High School. He <laughs> Nalu Hey, nice haircut too, by the way. That's Thank you. Good. Yeah. You want to give say who you got it from? Farley's. Is Farley's. You know. Yeah, you know uh, Philip Farley yeah, over in Hand to Hand, right next to the Price job. Wise. Yeah, yeah. He waxes my ears too. <laughs> He does. Oh. I said he does I'm a on, nice job. said I'm on I TV tomorrow. I haven't uh -huh. had any grooming for this whole holiday. You guys uh -huh. can zoom in. Go ahead. The ears look good. Yeah, they do. Hey, how was your Christmas, <laughs> by the way? It was great. Uh -huh. We got uh, mold replacement under our house. Mold and replacement. So they took out the old mold and put in new mold? or Well, no. It was just mold removal. Mold, mold removal. Mold removal. Okay. And so they, they sealed, sealed up, up the crawl they space. Up. Oh, it's beautiful Very under there. We had Christmas dinner under <laughs> there. <laughs> It's got a big blanket open out. Open all of our gifts under there. I uh, got underwear. Yeah. Yeah, so yeah. It, was real, it was a real good Christmas. Well, but it's all about family. Dryer. Yeah. And oh, yeah, our dryer, dryer uh, uh -huh. stopped right before Christmas. Uh -huh. <laughs> so Perfect it was, we just replaced That's a lot of stuff That's why you've been ordering Christmas. so many news clothes on Amazon. You That's right. Anything. Yeah, because we couldn't dry any of the old oh, stuff. <laughs> Your lovely wife is in the studio she with us is, today. Yes. And we appreciate she's her being here. I'm so lucky. Definitely the better half. That's no doubt about that. She is a foot smarter than me. I mean... <laughs> I, I think it's all the stuff that I have uh, on her that you know yeah. could ruin her career. Oh, you have she nothing on it. That's why she stays. Tell us about Miranda, Miranda. Lambert. Oh, Miranda is dating somebody. You know, her. there was there, there were some rumors for a while that she was dating a restaurateur in downtown Charleston. I don't know if you heard those or not. Who? No, uh, I well, not. I can't say who because. Oh, you can't uh, tease us uh, like that. But there, there were those rumors for a while, but. She is dating a new guy. His name is Anderson East. He's a singer. Um, I don't know if you are familiar with a guy named Jason Isbell, uh, Isbell. Mm -hmm. but um, he is great on like the Americana scene, the, the kind of the rock alternative scene. Um, he opens for Jason Isbell, and uh, they were here in Charleston. They did uh, something down in Savannah. So Miranda has has been in the area, and it looks like she's going to mm -hmm. spend New Year's Eve with this guy. I mean, they're they're been mm -hmm. going out since nice. Thanksgiving, and. They're in love and all that other stuff, just like Blake is in love with Gwen. Fast. And uh, You also wow. said Miranda's following Gwen on Twitter, but mm -hmm. Gwen has not returned the favor. Yeah, and it may be just because the holidays, you she know, and she hasn't been up on her follow follow social back. media. Yeah. Well, I mean, she certainly knows now because... Because it was you said a, it. Well, because <laughs> I said it, and, and I got it from a little magazine that not a lot of folks have heard of called People, People. Magazine. Yeah. Oh. So um, that news seems to be pretty solid, but she hasn't followed Miranda back yet, so we'll see how that goes. Mm -hmm. I'm sure she Carrie will. Underwood. Carrie Underwood. Yeah. Busy, busy Christmas, and uh, you can tell by the family here in this Instagram pic, sure. their chill day on Sunday after Christmas that they are just slap worn out. This is her husband, the <laughs> hockey player, and her little baby, Isaiah, and they're just relaxing after a really tough Christmas. And uh, it, it, she probably needed the rest because she has a busy couple of days. Tonight, she's gonna be uh, the headliner at the Belk Bowl in mm -hmm. Charlotte, big football game up there. Then she runs to New York. And New then York, tomorrow yeah. night in New York, she'll be there with Ryan Seacrest. Yeah. Luke Bryan's gonna be there. Like mm -hmm. I mentioned, they'll roll out the corpse of Dick Clark near the end and that's the ball will drop. Nice. That's that's nice. And um, so, yeah, and uh, that'll be a big night tonight, or yeah. tomorrow night. Carrie Underwood here on ABC, Ryan Seacrest's New Year's Rock. Can't miss it. That's cool. Yes. How about a little Rascal Flats, man? They're uh, doing some big time stuff next year. Yeah, they're, uh, they, they have a new album coming out. They've been working on some new music. Mm -hmm. In fact, the new single we're playing on Weasel called I Like the Sound of That mm -hmm. was written by pop star Megan Trainer. You know all about that bass. Mm -hmm. um, and they're oh, going yeah. to they're gonna be... <laughs> it's all about <laughs> that bass. bass. I'll that spark bass. something yeah, there with Tom. <laughs> I, it was like the light came on. Did you ding, see ding, that? Ding. Was, I took us both a second. Well, it's, it's, it's watching. <laughs> Aaron's digest, two little yeah. girls do it because it's cute as can be. You yeah. know? As I let it go, you know, when they all do all the singing and everything. Do they do yeah. that like that? Oh, they just Broadway? like that. Yeah. yeah. They watch Uncle Tom first. Oh, wow. This Uncle Tom. You let Uncle Tom. Uh, Uncle Tom. Oh, you know, does Uncle Tom come I over there? Can babysit. Tell us about Bye. this Rascal Flats in Vegas starting in February. Yeah, you know, a lot of the, uh, the artists that are established superstars, but um, 
you know, not the brand new artists that, that are kind of red hot right now. They've mm -hmm. kind of found a place in uh, in Vegas at mm -hmm. these Vegas re residencies that they do. They're going to be there in February, I think, the 17th through the first part of March. Hard Rock Cafe. Just like Hard a Rock a Cafe. Hard Rock Cafe. Okay. Yeah. But Brooks and Dunn out mm -hmm. there with Reba. Mm -hmm. Tim McGraw did a stint out there. Mm -hmm. Garth Brooks, mm -hmm. that's kind of where he got his footing back to head back out on the road for concerts. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. Vegas has been really, really good to these. I, I, I almost hate to say it like that, but these aging country stars, the real established country mm -hmm. stars where the, the folks that don't want to go to Vegas necessarily to gamble but want, uh, you know, a touristy experience, oh, mm -hmm. yeah. they the shows. they get to go they get That's to go cool. see a show like yeah. this. Some great shows. Dirk's Bentley. What's yeah. the, it's like a polar plunge that every taken? Year, every <laughs> year, Dirk's does a polar plunge, and he always makes the folks, whoever is on tour with him, do the plunge with him. Oh, um, really? Last year, it was Lucky Maddie Dirk. and Tay and Kip Moore, and, you know, last year, it was really 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 cold yeah um, that was I mean just the whole area was blanketed in freezing mm -hmm. temperatures this year I they thought they were gonna be able to dodge the bullets um, because you know just like here it's been 75 80 degrees sure. in Nashville well the weather is turning like it is here and mm -hmm. it's gonna be mm -hmm. a real polar plunge in Nashville mm -hmm. on New Year's Day so I'm not sure I, I tried to find out who's out on tour with him mm -hmm. but um, he is going to be in Nashville. It may be the same tour. He may make Maddie and Tay and Kip mm -hmm. Moore do the plunge with him, but that's just something jump? he does it's every a lake. year. Where are they jumping? Yeah, it's in? a little lake just outside of Nashville, mm -hmm. not far from where he lives, and uh, mm -hmm. they jump in there, and that's how they kick off their new year. Maybe they should try it down in Key West, down there with sushi. <laughs> You ever is that the little horse that was here? No, no, oh. no, no, no. It's, it's a, uh, Bring back that little horse. Tom's going off the deep end. You love that little horse. I do. I rode him around here. It was, no, that didn't. was awkward for a minute. No. Uh, Rick Rush, always a pleasure. Get away from me. Always a pleasure, my friend. Run a clock on me. Yes, sir. You know it. <laughs> Thank you. It's always a pleasure. Happy New Year. Happy guys. New Year. Guys, thanks for dressing up. Mm -hmm. I love That's this. Stay with good. us. We've got more We're coming up after the break soon. in just a moment.